Well, 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 look who's back. Standing in front of some redstone. It's me, Math Maddy. Oh, yes. I'm back to doing some redstone, and to start it all off, I want to recreate some of my old shorts, tutorials, videos, you know, as regular old tutorials so that more people can enjoy the designs and maybe get some use out of it. And first, we have this awesome automatic cauldron refilling machine. You walk up to your cauldron and go like, ah, I need some more water. You take it out, automatically gets refilled. So without further ado, let's hop straight into the tutorial. All right, start off by building a couple of blocks up from the ground and then place down your cauldron. Now fill that cauldron with water just like that, then go right below it and place an observer, just like this. This is used to detect if we take water out of the cauldron. Here you would then place a redstone torch right on this block. You can now destroy that block if you wish to do so. And now get some more blocks right here. And start off by building another repeater right here that is just on one tick, like this. Block, torch, and another block, and another torch, of course. And then we want another block before we finally put the piston in here. And as you can see, that already extends. That's working very well, just as we want it to. That's nearly done already though. Now the only thing that's left to do is to build the water refilling mechanism and something so that it doesn't repeat infinitely. For the water refilling thing, just place a solid block on here or whatever help block you want to then place that stair right there, just like that. And next to that, just place some blocks to block off the water because we are now going to waterlock that stair like that and now you can already go ahead and take a bucket and take water out of there but you'll very quickly notice that it may have not been the best idea to do that because now it's in an infinite loop and we definitely do not want that to happen to do this, just go right here and place a couple of help blocks if you want to. Then take another repeater, place it right here, put it on four ticks, place another block right here, redstone dust going into it, and then another torch, like this. And now it should stop, yes it did. Amazing! Now you can take water out of it as much as you want for forever basically so i hope you like this little tutorial and let's see i'll probably make a lot more in the future and also some other things are coming soon so stay tuned for that maybe even subscribe like dislike the video whatever you want if you enjoyed it then like obviously and if you didn't then dislike it as long as you can, before YouTube completely removes the dislikes, like, use that feature. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that it was a smart decision of YouTube to remove them, but whatever. It's their decision, not mine. Alright, thank you very much for watching and goodbye.